A pleasant morning, my dear students. Again, Mom Bautista is back. So let us now go to the next topic that is related in Module 4, which tackles about parts of sewing machine under bed. It's very important for us to identify the different parts related in under bed because the proper identification of its part gives us an idea on how to troubleshoot it when you encounter a problem during the operation. But before that, let us review first. So identify the following parts of sewing machine. Number one. Number one is pull pin. Number two. The balance wheel. Three is the stitch wheel regulator. Number four. Thread guide. Five needle. Six presser foot. Seven bobbin case and compartment. Number eight is the bobbin. So we will take a closer look on this part because it is part of the underbed. So now let us go to the main topic which talks about parts of sewing machine under bed or under the bed. So I will show you the six parts and later on we will give the definition. The needle bar. This one is the needle. And then presser foot. Throat plate. The feed dog under the presser foot. And the bobbin case. So the needle bar, it holds the needle in place with the use of clamp and with the use of screwdriver to adjust if you're loose or tighten. The next is the needle. Needle is a slender tool attached in the needle clamp used for sewing. First our foot, it holds the fabric in place while sewing. while the throat plate is the windows of the feed dog and it is where the bobbin threads comes out but this one so it serves as a window of the feed dog together with throat plate on the other side is the slide plate it is a mobile place that covers the shuttle and the bobbin case the shuttle is on this part it is where the bobbin case is being placed. The feed dog. The feed dog moves the fabric while sewing. The bobbin case, it holds the bobbin on place. And the bobbin is a metal spool for winding thread. And that's all and see you in the next lesson. God bless and always keep safe everyone.